So what we are now able to do really for the first time within the past approximately year is to print virtually exact replicas of major congenital heart defects. And the models that we print are soft so that we can actually use them to sew patches or to cut the vessels and move vessels to various places to uh, actually duplicate the types of operations that we do in children and babies. In terms of geometry, I think it is pretty precise. Why? The limitation of the medical image now is that the highest resolution is 0.7 millimeter resolution. But however, printer we use is a 0.3 millimeter resolution. So we have no limitation in representing what is seen in the medical imaging in the 3D prints. Some of these operations today, if I bring on a similar surgeon to me as when I started, I wouldn't have that surgeon touch one of those patients. So I can take one of those individuals who's eight, nine, ten years out of medical school and in training and say, Look, okay, you're ready to train on these models and you're going to perfect it on the models. Now I can get you to do it safely on a child at a much earlier phase in your career.